Hey, uh, welcome to uh, Brent's uh, Barrel Vault <clears throat> Dormer video. Brent's Daryl, uh, Brent's Barrel Vault Dormer video. Oh, Brent, he, he, I think he's a, a Norwegian or something. From one of those foreign countries. Anyway, he wants to build a, see this right here? See this picture right here? He wants to build that barrel vault right there. Now, look at this for a second. And what do you think that is? What is that, essentially? Get rid of, not, not a barrel vault. What is it? A curved roof? <clears throat> Let's simplify this. It's a gable roof, okay? Let's simplify it. Let's see if we can build this thing. It's a gable roof and... Uh, Whatever. You can see what it is. Try to simplify it in your mind and how to build it. So, let's see if we can build that. Uh, here, I, I built the I built the house right here. I think I got uh, 14 or 16 foot high plates. I put some windows in here. And I want to go ahead and build what he just asked me to build, I guess. So, let's go ahead and build this. Uh, let's see if I can do this right. I, I just want to set this up uh, uh, previously. One... So I'm, gonna, I'm just going to put a gable on this and just make it simple. And then we're going to modify it to what he wants. Sometimes it's simple. To, it's, it's, it's easier just to kind of break it down. Okay, so uh, two, two. I'm just going to extend these roofs on over. Not a, Okay, so we're all on the same page. You, you can see on the left-hand side what's going on. Now, these roofs, by the way, are U U and the uh, lock the pitch and the baseline is this, control C. I don't even know, know where that is, but who cares? So, for whatever reason, I have whatever set I have, whatever I have things set up at it, I'm going to lock this. I'm just going to raise the pitch up to whatever. It's, so, they're all the same. That's Now, you can see on the left-hand side, I'm sort of getting to where, where Brent wants to be. And if you go back to uh, the picture, you can see the plate line for this particular roof drops down below this popped up roof, doesn't it? So let's go ahead and just drop it down. And not hey, hey, you guys figure out how to do this. I mean, I'm, I'm trying to, uh, bah, bah, I'm going to drop it down four feet, minus four feet. And you guys can figure out, uh-huh, now we're starting to get somewhere, aren't we? Now we know that uh, three break, three break, and pull it back like this. That's sort of what's going on, isn't it? That is sort of what's going on. And I'm going to three break. I'm, I'm simplifying this now. Uh, two to uh, merge. Two to, oh, this is working out perfect, I think. There. That's a, look, 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 look. That's essentially, essentially what he has. Now he's going to put a window in there, WW, put a window right there. Raise it up to where, where, uh, wherever he wants it. Uh, raise it up to, say, say here. By the way, I don't have a ceiling in here. I shouldn't have a ceiling in here. You, you. Oh, I made a mistake. I made a mistake. No ceiling over this room. That's fine. Perfect. <gasps> Remember the DSH rule? Always have one extra floor. Then you have uh, floors for the actual structure. It's a one-story house. I'm keeping it simple. One-story house. I'm going to add another floor just because I want to. Build a new floor. I want to make a blank. I don't want anything to change. I just want I just want that there. I just want that to be there. Okay. So now I think I'm in the right. I, I'm looking pretty good. Let's see. Oops. Uh, let's see if I can bring this window up like this. Hopefully that works. Yeah, be good enough for me. Uh, seven seven. So I think that's essentially what he has. Center it in this space right there. Let's make it bigger. You, you, uh, with this 36. Let's make it a fixed glass window. 36, fixed glass, uh, uh, arch. I, I started my timer. Broken arch. Eight. Done. That's a timer. Yeah. Man, I'm... Now this, if you look at this, this is sort of what he... This is sort of... That's sort of what he has, isn't it? If you kind of look at uh, this picture right here, I know he has a curved roof, and we'll get into that, but uh, we're sort of there. Okay, done. Let's look at the inside of this place. I'm on the one, first store, uh, first floor, right? HJ. Let's look at this. Do we like it? No, we don't. Because we got, we got all this other crap going on. This is a this is a dormer. Let's make it a dormer, okay? Let's make this a dormer, man. 
Jeez Louise, come on. So if we take these two walls, control X, go up a level, uh, zero six to put it right in place, but you, you, make these, here's a key. Roof cuts wall at bottom. Roof cuts wall at bottom. Bink. Now, with any luck, F12, with any luck, I made this happen. <gasps> Not quite. On the outside, it looks pretty good, doesn't it? It's sort of what he wanted, I think. Now, why isn't this uh, behaving correctly? I, I know it should. You, but I just hate this crap. What's that dead? Oh, that's okay. That's okay. What am I doing wrong? What, what is? What am I doing wrong? Why? Why are these things sticking in here? I don't know. Let's let's see if we can figure that out. Uh, we're on the first level. Go up a level. These are the two walls we're talking about, I believe. Remember, they're on the second floor. They're one wall up, one floor up, and they are. Defined as roof cuts wall at bottom. And quite frankly, I do not know why. I haven't done these things in a while. I haven't done these in a while. Oh, uh, do I need to put this roof up on the upper level? Maybe so. Maybe so. Let me just check. Oh. It, ain't that interesting. You see what I did? I, I just fixed it. I just fixed it. So on the inside, now it's looking right, isn't it? Now on the inside, it's looking right. And I know you're going to complain about this thing here. Well, that's a matter of just pulling this wall over like this. Perfect. 7-7, seven, seven, pulling, getting this wall over here and pulling it over like this. Whoop. Perfect. Hey, that's hey, better than I would have thought. Man. There you go. That's what he's looking for, I think. Now, I, I don't have the curved roof. I get that, okay? But I think this is essentially what he's looking for, isn't it? And if you go up to here, go up to the upper level, see, I, I, I changed these things to whatever. I suppose what I'm getting at is it, it's sort of important to put these roofs on the upper level. This is sort of interesting. Suppose I send it back down. Do I, it's still, oh, it's still good. It's still good. F12. Let's, let's, let's rebuild it. Still good. Everything's good. Hey, hey, are you complaining? Oh, I'm complaining about that right there, aren't I? Oh, man. It's always a motherfucker. Let me see if I can do something here. Three. I, I, hey, I think the, the, uh, uh, the genesis of this whole question was, let me just pull this over just a smidge. Boop. And come over here at a three break. Pull it over just a smidge. All right, now. Now it looks pretty good there, doesn't it? Uh huh? Not bad, is it? Inside looks good. That's the key. A lot of time. Look, I don't do auto, auto dormers. I don't. I don't freaking get them, man. They're confusing as heck to me. I don't do auto dormers. I make them myself. Uh, HJ, come back here. The smarter guys know how to do them auto. I don't. But that looks pretty good. Outside looks pretty good. Now the problem is he wants the curved roof, okay? Let's go back to his picture. Do you think I have about, about what he's looking at? Let's look at it. I think so. My, uh, you can see what's going on. Why, why? So small. Can you see this? Look, compare, compare. This picture of this dormer to mine. This essentially the same thing, isn't it? Am I missing something? Uh, no. I mean, I, I know there's other walls on the other sides and stuff, but but this is essentially what he's, look, what he's looking for. But he wants the that roof to be curved. So now let's see if we can make it curved. So I'm, I've just uh, been sort of breaking it down. Now I know if I go up here. Uh, shift A. Oh. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Let's find out what this is. Oh, six foot five inches. All right. Now we're going to get to the roof. We're about to get to the roof. And this is about, this is the real key. I think this is the, the, 
an issue that he's having, probably. This timer up. Time, uh, I'm, I'm about done. I think. Here it is. Ready? Ready? Let's look at this picture again. There's this picture on the left. Now, you know the distance between the two walls, two side walls on the dormer is six foot five. I just mentioned that, six foot five. You look on the right hand side, six foot five. So that would mean if it was a true arc, the radius would be three foot two and a half, wouldn't it? But it looks like it's bigger than that. So I'm going to assume the radius is eight foot. I'm, I'm just going to make it up, eight foot. I'm going to make an eight foot radius on this curved roof right here, okay? Now here we go. Take this, and first of all, I take no credit for this. This is a uh, David Michael, David Michael, chief tutor guru who taught me this. You, you select this roof. It's a curved roof, curved roof, and I'm going to tell you. That the radius is eight foot. Let me see if I did this right. Tab. I'm also going to tell you that the pitch is zero. This is the key. The pitch should be zero because it's, at, it's a curved roof and it wraps around. So let's just see what happens. Let's see what happens. Ah, not bad, huh? I think it's starting to work. Boop, boop. Here it is. Here's the roof. And I'm going to, wait, where is it? Right, there's a roof. And I'm going to extend it over like, uh, hang on. Well, I, actually, there, actually, there's two ways of doing this, I think. Hey, you, you have to work out your own math, okay? I'm just telling you, you got to work out your own math. Uh, 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 I want to make this a little bit simpler for me because I'm a nitwit. Uh, okay, just, just... Let's think about this for a second. And and you you can actually type in well, that's actually not bad. Let's see, is there is there two ways of doing this? Suppose I just took this roof uh and copied it. Oh wait, I copied it, oh five, and I'm gonna pivot around the ridge line. What do you think happens? And eh, ain't good. I don't like it. Delete. That didn't work very well, did it? So I'm going to pull this over like this. I'm going to three break it here. I'm going to pull it down like this if you get what I'm saying. And it still is not good. It still ain't good. I, I guess David uh, David Michael didn't teach me very well, did he? You, you. Ah, uh, see, the freaking pitch changed, didn't it? I'm going to lock the baseline height. I'm going to change this, this to zero, tab. And with any luck, uh, I'm gonna see what happens. This is all there. That's sort of that's that's better. Okay, that that is better. You, you get what I'm saying? This is and you just you. I mean, I can get into the details on this. I think the uh, radius is shallower. That's the key. The radius is shallower. Uh, and if I was to uh, that roof is on the lower level and at level one. I'm going to move it up one level. I'm going to move it up to one level. One level right there. Now I'm going to go up to the upper level. There it is right there. Oh, it's not even square. What a nitwit. Let's square this thing up like this. Now let's see if we can uh, MK. Let's get a dimension here. Six. I find that parallel, man. Two. Now let's do this. One foot six. Let's do this. And is this the same as one foot six? I, I want the eaves to be the same. That's all I'm changing. The eaves. 18 inches. Perfect. Okay. Now you're going to say, well, sh his is steeper than that. Okay. I'll, I'll change it, man. I'll change it. You, you. Change it to um, the radius. Uh, I want to decrease the radius. Decrease it. How about 100? Pitch is, here, look, the pitch is zero. That's important. That is important, I think. There. Looking better. Now all you do is you take this roof uh, and send it back down to the lower level. 
go down to the lower level, take this and uh, and merge it with that, I think. If I'm lucky, there, there we go. And then I'm gonna take this and merge it with that. Hey, 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 you Emma, Emma, Emma you know what? That's essentially what he has. So, you know, kind of break this thing down. And do you notice that this is really just a simple gable roof? And then I converted it. I made it a simple gable roof and then I converted it into the curve. I created the gable, the uh, dormer walls by defining these walls as a roof cuts wall at bottom. And I put them on the upper floor. I put them on the floor above these walls down here. That's all I did. I don't think... And then I had to kick the computer a couple times and F12 and jiggle jaggle and the whole thing built correctly. Oh, and, it's, and now I need to just simply tweak this again. That's pretty good over there, isn't it? And I get the fact that this isn't perfect. This is probably Chief's own problem. I, I, I'm not sure if you can fix that real, uh, to get that a real, to, uh, to get that to be a real clean look. Now you got a problem over here, so you just extend this. And now I have to extend this again from what I did before because I converted it from a gable to a curved roof. That's all I did. Now, if you want, you can say, "Well, I wanted a steeper pitch. Well, let's just uh, let's just move this down a little bit." And you guys have to figure out the plate lines of these things. Uh, minus twelve. See how easy that was. But I want to increase the pitch. Uh, the uh, I want to increase the uh, decrease the radius. 80. I'm, I'm not sure if that's right. Again, make sure that the pitch is zero. The pitch is zero. Why is the pitch zero? Because it's right at the peak of the roof. There's no, it's a curved roof. Anyway, this is where the peak is zero, uh, the pitch is zero right at the top. That's all we're doing. So now I, all I do is go bump uh, two and hit it. Yeah, see, this gets kind of muddled in here. Two and hit it. Hey, hey, you. How'd I do, man? Yeah, that was pretty good. I think. You know, I don't do a lot of these curved roofs, and and uh, I give all the credit to David Michael uh, of Cheap Tutor, who uh, taught me how to do this. And now we're back to, you know, we got a pretty nice, clean look on the inside. W. Uh, and now you can see that. Hang on. Let me see if I can do this right. Is mine much different than his? No. And I know, I mean, his 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 eaves are zero and or whatever. You can work that out pretty easy. You just get rid of the gutters and stuff. But I essentially did what he did. What what he wanted. Hey. Nice. There you go. Hey, hey, thanks, thanks for the question. Just don't e private email me again. Put it on the website, doggone it. I, I, I don't, I don't want, if everybody private emailed me, I, I, I wouldn't get any work done. Put it on the site. Someone else can do it or I can do it later, but don't private email me unless you want to pay me. If you want to pay me, I'll do whatever you want. That's the end of the, uh, That's the end of Brent's uh, barrel dormer video. Barrel dormer video. That's the end.